small, passionate, and miraculous. Three words that describe Altus Biologics. Here, Dr. Nick Dunias, Nuno Perez, and their small team of scientists produce what they call the osteogenic bone matrix. It is a type of paste that gets injected into a bone that refuses to heal. When the OBM comes into contact with a broken or degrading bone, fusion takes place. The bone regenerates itself. One remarkable case, a man whose job was to be a truck driver, he was held up and sustained a gunshot injury to the hand and he fractured two bones in the hand. So the implication is that this man is now um, in a position that he cannot work. After OBM was injected into his hands, the victim was back behind the wheel in about three months. Because he went to work too soon, it started to angulate. You see there's an angle yeah, forming there. Yeah, yeah. So he's able to go back to work because he's got a union here mm -hmm. and a partial union here. But this okay. is the, the really the, the remarkable part of this. So what makes OBM so different to other bone graft substitutes? A substitute product for our own or comp competitor to ours would be a demineralized bone matrix, DBM. But that doesn't have the significant growth factors <clears throat> that our product has. Our product has a complex of growth factors as a naturally occurring bone, but with a high, far higher uh, amount, a far higher let's say, what would be concentration of growth factors. The cost per injection is between 38 and 1,100 US dollars, depending on the type of injury. Dr. Nick's team now awaits further regulatory approval so they can expand their business into Africa. Over the years, the company has received various awards. Last week, they beat 700 entrants to win the prestigious 2014 Innovation Prize for Africa, an award ceremony Dr. Nick and Perez won't easily forget. Dr. Nick tripped on his way to receive the award, and the check got lost on their way home. So the prize money wasn't able to cover the, the damages, but they still gave it to us. Fortunately for the skeletal regeneration scientist, he didn't break a leg. Shanae Hale, Pretoria. No more. ENCA.com.